launch IPOB slash ESN gunmen capture weapons in Abia State. Good morning, everyone, and thank you all for tuning in and listening to this headline that we got to your ears this morning. As our headline for this morning says here that launch IPOB slash ESN gunmen capture weapons in Abia State. The Nigerian army has said that its troops have successfully dislodged and destroyed a terrorist camp belonging to the indigenous people of Rafia, IPOB, and the Eastern Security Network, ESN. The army, in a post on its official ex handle on Saturday, said the operation was conducted early in the day in the Ezeri forest of Mwaka Oku Ujikwe local government area of Imo State. It said the operation, which also extended to Akanwa and Lomara communities in the local government area of Abia State resulted in the capture of a general purpose machine gun, GPMG, and other assorted items. It says the troop acting on actionable intelligence regarding the harassment and intimidation of local residents by the terrorist element swiftly mobilized to neutralize the threats. According to the post, troops in Arriva engaged the terrorists in a fair shootout, dislodging them from their camp. It added that the troops exploited their success and gave the fleeing terrorists a hot pursuit, compelling them to abandon a significant cache of arms. D this, it said, includes one GPMG assorted rounds of ammunition, two, two motorcycles, and two communication radios. The operation underscores the Nigerian Army's um, commitment to maintaining peace and security in the region. Troops will be decisive in the, the dismantling any threat to ensure the safety of the communities. This significant operation serves as a testament to the Army's dedication to protect civilians and combating terrorism. The successful operation has not only served to disrupt the activities of the terrorist group, but also sends a strong message on the Army's resolve to restore and maintain order in the affected area, it said. And that is all that we have for you concerning this headline today this morning, which says here that Lodge, IPOB, and ESN gunmen capture weapons in Abia State. Well, of recently, the Nigerian army said that their troops, their men, they recently um, successfully encountered some IPOB and ESN terrorists and destroyed their terrorist camp. And they took a lot of ammunition and a lot of weapons belonging to the IPOB and ESN. Yes. The armies all said this in their post of recently on their official ex handle. Yes. They said that the operation extended to the Akwa Nektendo Alumara communities in the Umoshi local government area of Abia State. It resulted to the capture of a general purpose machine gun. You know how powerful that gun is a general purpose machine gun and other rifles of other kinds. Well, looking up the comments about this, well, to me, I really like what the, action, the Nigerian army did about this. Well, you can see that there are less more terrorists now in the country. Looking at the comment section, Carlos Fernando said that Nigeria are very wicked. Alsa, Fulani, and Yorubas, how can you call IPOB and ESN a terrorist? Why IPOB and ESN a freedom fighter resistance army? The Northern Nigeria bandit Boko Haram and Alsa and Fulani Buaris are the terrorists. Well, to me, I really support this person speaking in the comment section. Although, the IPOB and ESN, they are not terrorists, they are freedom fighters. Yes, they are freedom fighters, they are not terrorists. Even uh, Mako even uh, 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 took a suit that said that anybody that is calling the IPOB or ESN terrorists, they can ch fight the person, charge them, sue the person to court. Yes, he took a lawsuit for that. The IPOB and ESN, they are not terrorists, they are just freedom fighters, but they, we can see some evil doers in their midst. Trying to use this as, a, as, a, as an advantage to cause fear and terror in the land. Yes, trying to use this to cause fear and terror in the land. Okay, Muhammad uh, Muhammad says that kill them, they are all animals. Killing is not the answer. Killing is never the answer. Like, what would you call about the Boko Haram who they released in the previous years? Yes. Did they, did they kill them when they captured them? No. So, killing them is not the answer. Okay, Dr. Santos Vukes says that leave them and lie alone and go and dislodge Boko Haram and Fulani headsmen terrorists of over 15 years. <laughs> he said that you should leave the IPOB and ESN alone. Go to the north and fight Boko Haram terrorists that you guys have been facing, facing for for over 15 years. Sonny Oku says that keep receiving the government and gullible Nigerians to think you are working. Keep deceiving the government and gullible Nigerians to think you are working. Everywhere you, everywhere you find criminals, is, is there any you, you decorate the place and label it IPOB. Clap for yourself. Wow. 
although what he wrote is not really correct but i, I think i can understand what he says it says that anywhere you find criminals in the southeastern part of nigeria you will label it as ipob and esn which is not right yes which is not right it's not everywhere you see criminals you label it as ipob or esn no it is not right seriously the nigerian army has to stop that but we could say that if these people were actually ipob or esn they did we, let, let us just be true to ourselves the army did a good job saving the innocent people like how would all the civilians hold so much ammunition and so much rifles like that when I mean, they're not even military personnel okay joachim ak said that now today i know say all these things now lie i people know they use this kind of weapons <laughs> So what type of weapons are the IPOB really use? Tell us, you can write more in the comment section. Yes. It says IPOB know they use this all this kind of weapon. So the army is really lying concerning the kill with the IPOB. Concerning the encounter with the IPOB. People are even saying that maybe the Nigerian army fought on that group. Another group of maybe Andrews or kidnappers or, and it's that labeling it as IPOB gunmen, trying to do one or just trying to get the fame. Because you know that anytime the Nigerian army encounter one of the IPOB they will be like oh my god we just stopped this, this group of people we just stopped the IPOB doing this we just stopped the IPOB doing that maybe they, they just want a piece of that fame and glory again so what do you guys think really, really what do you guys think concerning this because there's a lot of weapons that were conf confiscated by the Nigerian army what do you guys think let me see your comment below in the comment section don't forget to leave a like on this video then tap the subscribe button the big red one with the notification bell so that anytime or any new video concerning this you'll be the first to get notified about it once again, thank you all for tuning in and have a wonderful day out of you.